Tonight, the Chula Vista City Council unanimously approved the use of controversial license plate readers. People concerned about crime, privacy advocates, and the sister of missing Chula Vista mother, Maya Miliete, all spoke at tonight's city council meeting. CBS 8's Rocio de la Fe was there and explains what tonight's vote means for the city. This is to make sure that our community is protected. The Chula Vista City Council voted unanimously to pass the use of automated license plate readers. We want to make sure that our police have the tools that they can use to be able to do their job as well as they can. Chula Vista police say they've seen an uptick in vehicle thefts over the last three years. Vehicle thefts increased by 28.5% in 2022. Vehicle accessory theft, which includes catalytic converters, is also up by 42%. More than 800 vehicles have been stolen this year so far. Last month, the department received a $3 million grant to combat these crimes. The grant will fund a detective position to investigate the crimes, new vehicles, and the installation of 150 license plate cameras around the city. City. And it's all built on ingress, egress of our city. So when you look at the whole 52 square miles, we're trying to cover on the main thoroughfares. The council heard from dozens of speakers in favor of the technology, many who have been victims of crime. The camera will protect the residents of Chula Vista. We have to protect the victims. And far too often what we're doing is protecting the criminals. A lot of these cars that are stolen in this community and then across the border within five or ten minutes. Among the speakers was Maya Melieta's sister who vanished from her Chula Vista home in 2021. She insisted that the cameras could have helped police in their investigation into her sister's disappearance. It's my sincerest belief that if Chula Vista and the surrounding city had the license plate readers activated at the time of her disappearance, the investigators would have greater chance in locating her. Those against the technology argue the license plate readers pose a threat to the community's privacy. We don't know where technology is going in the future, and so just because something doesn't exist today doesn't mean that it won't in the future. Rocio de la Fe, CBS 8.